Hi guys, welcome to Essential Updates and I just literally got out from my sonography class today so I have time to cover for the math um, portion of the T6 exam. So hopefully this will help you just like my previous videos about the T's and okay so let's get started. Now with math, um, definitely know the PEMDAS and the PEMDAS is basically the parentheses exponent, multiplication, division, addition, subtraction. So if you're given a set of um, number and you have to follow the rules of PEMDA, so from uh, left to right um, when you calculate sets of numbers and the way I uh, remember it is by mnemonic, please excuse my dear Aunt Sally. So if, if you can remember that then you will be okay and also one tip, you can actually write it down um, in your scratch paper when you start your real test um, that at least that's what I did and I never forget it so that's good um, you will have to know the circumference of an area um, conversion problems like ounces to pounds kilometer to meters um, centimeters to inches um, the you have to know at least the basic guys because if it's like a big problem then the in the real test they will uh, it is already provided, which is the conversion, if it's a huge number, but the basic like um, centimeters to yards, they will not provide you with that one. And then um, you will have to know the hypotenuse of a triangle. So with the way I was able to do it, it's just a triangle, it will give you um, one number C13 and you will have to um, calculate just that one number and so if you're not familiar with it just search about it so you will know how to calculate the hypotenuse of a triangle and another thing is you no know, converting fractions um, percentages it's very basic for example if you buy something in the store um, a set of shoes and it has 25 percent you know what's your total bill or what is the 15% um, of $500 for example and also know the compare, comparing rational numbers, um, placing numbers in order from biggest to smallest, and fractions, dividing, multiplying, and placing them in order. So when you place them in order, you definitely have to read the questions, guys, because um, it might be it asks you to place from um, smallest to biggest or biggest to smallest. So don't just assume that directly. So you just have to. Uh, remember to read the questions and then with algebra problems um, example how old is Sam if he is five years older than Liz or from if you are going to point from point A to point B and you're driving 35 miles an hour how, how long are you you know is it gonna take you to reach um, to point B so if you're not familiar with math, my suggestion is to go over with the practice exam of your review book like in the T-Secret or ATI book. Once you've done that, then I think you'll be ready to ace the math problem. It's not as hard as you think it is. Um, I'm afraid of math, but eventually, you know, it is the second highest score that I got in my T-6. So, and I did um, took my algebra 12 years ago, so I have to relearn everything, but I, I was able to make it So I was very happy about that. But anyway, that's all the math um, it, There's no surprises in math as long as you do your review in your book Then that's exactly what will come out, but of course in different numbers um, They give you different numbers different problems, but the idea is the same So I hope this will help you guys and uh, thank you very much for your time until next time, if you have any questions, don't forget to leave a comment below. Thank you. Bye.